to our state of growth series as more individuals move to our area. The city of Fountain becoming a very popular spot, but it's struggling to keep up with housing demand, especially when it comes to the water. News has Aaron Chapman live with us outside City Hall to share why the city hasn't been able to approve new developments, Aaron. Yeah, Elizabeth, every home requires a water tap. And usually the city of Fountain has been able to keep up with this growth. But actually, this past year, almost tens of thousands of folks have wanted to move to the area, which is actually tapping out their water supply. Kelly Allen and her husband never thought they would run into trouble when they wanted to move from one side of town to the other. We could not find anything. I mean, as soon as things were coming on, they were popping right back off. Explaining to buyers why there's no inventory is very difficult. The reason behind that, the city's water supply. I can never even imagine it being water. According to Dan Blankenship with the city, Fountain serves close to 9,000 water customers. In the past, that number increased by only one or 200 every year. But in the last six to nine months, the city received more than two dozen development applications, which would amount to about 30,000 additional water taps something the city doesn't have. We did not have the, the capacity to uh, serve all of the uh, prospective developments that, uh, that were proposed for, for this area. On a daily basis, Blankenship says prospective developers and landowners would walk into his door. We meet with them up front and we explain our situation. We've been very uh, transparent uh, and very forthcoming about our situation. While the situation has home buyers confused, it's been hectic and it's been um, difficult and at times discouraging. They go to buy a home and they don't win. And then they don't win again. And then they don't win for the ninth time or the tenth time. The city works to find a solution. I don't think anybody could have, could have predicted that. A master plan is currently in the works and the city will soon be able to identify those available resources over the next 30 years. Now, at this point in time, the city tells me that for those folks that are already existing customers, they do not have to worry and that there is enough water supply. For now, always watching out for you, Fountain. I'm Erin Chapman, News 5.